Hey guys, and today we're going to review the um, Kitty Zoom Studio or the Kitty Zoom Action Cam. So, one picture quality. So, if you like, if you want stuff where you could just um. Where uh, it's lower quality and the microphone is a little bit better, then go for the Kitty Zoom Studio because um, one, it sounds a bit better, and two, um, the picture quality is a bit worse than this one. But I will show you what the microphone is like. This is the test of the microphone. And um, the test of this one is a big difference. This is the test of the microphone. So if if you want like if you want uh, more picture quality, like more brightness and more louder microphone, get this. Or if you want like m like the more quality of picture and and um uh and the microphone and the picture quality go for this one this sounds better and it and it's less quieter but two storage the storage for this one, you can go up to 16 gigabytes, which is probably like, uh, I'm not sure, probably like 12 minutes on 16 gigabytes on this one. And, um, and for 32 gigabytes, that's the most on this one, you can record up to 112 minutes. <laughs> so, um, if you want like this, if you want HD on both of these, get a memory card. But um, if you want, if you want like a smaller camera and um, and it and um. If you want a smaller camera, then go for this one. And if you want, uh, if you want like to go bike riding with this, go for it. It comes with a bike clamp, uh, adhesive so that you could put it on a helmet or skateboard, um, and uh, then. If you want that type of stuff going outside, buy this one. But if you want indoor green screen stuff and and if you want like that type of stuff, buy this one because um because it comes with a green screen and um this is good for it. So, look what happens. The camera flips. But, if you just want, like, this, then, um, it doesn't have a flip-up camera. But, if you just want it to be on your helmet, like this, clamped to your helmet, then you can't see it. But, if you clip it to your bike, or put the adhesive on the on your skateboard, then you can see it. So um, y you might need to get this if you want to do that type of stuff, or just buy a four hundred ninety nine pounds GoPro. <laughs> and free. If you need a waterproof case, do this. It it comes with a waterproof case, and uh, I'll get it. For you. 
This is the waterproof case. It comes with this. Uh, of course, it comes with a wristband. Um, it comes with a wide angle lens and um, that type of stuff. So it comes like this. So you just remember it's the right way because I I did it upside down the first time. So uh, you need it to be like this. And um, you need to clip it in like this. Boop, it's in. And then you close this bit. You you get the clamp here. And then you just squeeze as hard as you can. And then it locks in place. So um, if you want a waterproof case, then do this one. But if you just want like a green screen and a tripod plus um, a handle, then get this one. But I just told to use this one, so I don't really need to explain it. Four, you, um, the microphone sounds better on this one, and the microphone sounds. Uh, loud on this one but the picture quality is lighter and dark things but if you want like indoor stuff then do this one because it's a little bit the light is a little bit um the light is a little bit um worse but if you want this then then and if you want more more brightness that dark things get this one but the microphones seven the microphones so i mean five microphones so this one sounds a bit better the the um because a bit a bit better because it's quieter and like if you like loud voices like me then you choose this one because then it filters it down more but um if you want like louder microphones and it does sounds a bit weird then um buy this one so That's all for today. Bye, guys. Bye. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. Bye.